Hello fellow skeptics, Lester the Skeptic Tank here. Appreciate your patience. I know I haven't put out much these days. Work has kept me busy. Life has kept me busy as well. I'm just going to do something real quick for you guys. Barely going to get this out of our way. I know there has been inquiry, and this is the only way I'm able to answer it. So this surrounds the app Gilded. Gilded, I only came across recently. And for those, especially on Slackware, there are ways to get that deb file and install it. Uh, you might have seen me run it through the command line. Deb to TGZ, I believe, is the command line app. So I've been using that. And there, the specific inquiry was, how do I get the app image? Now, the only way it seems is to have it already pre-installed and upon launch you'll get prompted so I apologize I apologize again about the scaling here it's just because I'm running a 4k monitor and I do like my scaling at 100% sometimes the 150 can get a little funny looking but this is the only way that I know of is you already have the gilded app installed and then at some point when you launch it again, I would imagine in the background there is a back end related pull or pull for an update and going off of that. So what I'm going to do is download what's available because you can still download the deb file. That's all good and well. And then the, then the app image. I'm going to download the app image and I'm going to I'm going to go ahead and save it. And I'm going to save it to my desktop. I'm going to see if I can anyway. Oh, it looks like I'm denied access. I'm going to change that. Hang on a second here. I'm going to try it again. So that was just, I'm going to do Gilded. And then I'm going to get prompted again. Do I want the dev or do I want the app image? I'm going to download the app image. I'm going to save it to Documents. At least for me, that's going to be the, the easiest way for me to download it. Alright. So it looks like... I'm able to go to documents. So I'm going to go back to my main workspace. So that's what happens when you run workspaces within the K desktop environment. And it'll go to a browser that's available. So I'm going to open documents. And that's going to be in places. So let me bring that here. And what we should see here is if I'm going to type, I'm going to look for gilded. There it is. I'm going to execute it. And I'm going to continue. All right, there it is. Again, this is the only way I know of obtaining the the simple app image which in many respects, it's a nice way to keep the footprint within your overall Linux system to a minimum. If that's what you want, there is something to be said about the integration within the system, which isn't as invasive as Windows. So there you have it. Again, main thing, having the Gilded app already installed, give it the time necessary so that when updates are recognized on the back end, the next time you launch, you will be given a prompt to update it. There's a new version available. Discord kind of acts the same way. And then once that pop up about, hey, there's a new version available, do you want to download it in the deb file ver form or do you want the app image? Again, that is the only way I know where you can get the actual app image. All right. Well, thank you again for your time, fellow skeptics. Until next time, I'll catch you on the other side and peace out.